this rocking makes me nauseous. Could be worse. I must stop thinking of bad things all. What's this? Tsunami? Please. Oh, it feels like a bad movie. Knife? What are you gonna do with the knife, Nick? Sorry, baby. But this is the only way to get off the island. The only way? You're crazy! No! Is he serious? What's going on here? Ugh. So much for a vacation. Tom, 32 years old. Tom sells cars and he's good at it. He tries his best in everything in his life and often succeeds. Of course, it's tiring to live such a life. After pulling off a big deal, Tom decided to take a much needed vacation. Where am I? Oh, it looks like a cliche tropical island. I'm gonna look around. Tom, you're alive! John, 40 years old. John is a linguist and specialist in dead languages. Like many scientists, he can sometimes act absent-mindedly. He has studied ancient writings for many years. One day, the academic Sendin decided to send him to the research center in Oceania. John was not a happy camper about this. John! What's this place? Are a shipwrecked? Remember the giant wave? Oh, yeah. Uh, that's when I hit my head. There are more survivors. Let's find them. <laughs> we have one more survivor. Nick, 28 years old. Nick is a sailor who cooks. Nick is an orphan, or at least he thinks so. He's been a sailor since he was young. He likes to joke around, and he also thinks he's a ladies' man. I know you. Are you Nick? Yes. Where have we met? In my dream, there was a woman. Never mind. I must be delirious. You bared a lot. Stop yapping already. We need to set up a camp. Mike, 48 years old. Mike is a Native American who has never left his home until now. He wanted to see the world, so he went on a voyage. How's your hat? No dizziness? It means you haven't lost your brains. <laughs> Eat something. You'll feel better. Want a banana? Nicole, 30 years old. Nicole is a kind and caring person. She's a pediatrician who devotes her life to kids. She also spends a lot of time with Girl Scouts. Nicole ended up on the boat by chance when her friends gave her a cruise for her birthday. Tom, I'm Nicole. Everyone's soaking wet and freezing. We need to make a fire. Goodness, I hope no one gets a cold. We have no medicine, not even a thermometer. There should be some dry wood around here somewhere. Waves usually leave things on the beach. Free would be enough for the fire. Thank you. My hands are, are numb. I'll make a fire right away. Lifeboat's canvas as a roof. We just need logs. When you find four pieces, please bring them to me.
Thanks for the logs. Can you help me set up the tent? I'm not good at it. Perfect. Thank you. There was a box of tools on the lifeboat. Maybe it was washed ashore. Okay. I'll try to find it. Yes, this is the box we need. Fishing line, hooks. Here, the rod is ready. Do you know how to fish? A little. Don't forget the bait. I'll go look for a shovel in our stuff. Who knows, maybe I can find it there. I could be wrong, but I don't think Nick is a sailor. Um... I mean, he's not a real sailor. I peeped in the ship's kitchen and saw him in there. It's important to have a good cook on board. I didn't find a shovel in our things. It must be in another box with equipment. Look around the shore. Who knows what you may find? Rubbish. These are tool parts. Give me a minute. I'll find the right parts. Here's your shovel. Thanks. Look at what I found. What's that? This is ancient writings. A letter. A letter? What does it mean? No idea, but I'll figure it out. 